I'm so excited about this this morning on Saturday morning. I don't know, March the 3rd, I think it is. Maybe it's the 4th. But as, as I've shown before, I have a lot of planting beds and corn, 1,500 plants of asparagus, about 1,000 coconut trees. It takes a long time to water all this. And uh, we've been doing it with these little sprinkler that you stick in the ground, but they they don't go up very high. Pretty soon my corn and coconuts are going to be tall enough that I need to get over them. So I'm not sure if you can see this or not. I drew a little picture of this uh, tower. Let's see here. Can you see it there? And uh, I gave it to the blacksmith, which is what they call a welder here and had him make me three of them and now the sprinkler heads fit on top of them you can see they're about mm, two meters tall something like that so as the plants get taller it'll spray over the top of them but also it seems to give it a little bit farther reach now so here we are watering the asparagus and fruit trees and coconuts this morning and what we're also doing is covering up the asparagus for the hot months that are about to come. I make a lot of leaves here. A lot of leaves. And so we've saved them up and bagged them. Now we're going to cover the asparagus. That's what Salvador's doing there is covering the little asparagus plants so that the sun won't evaporate the moisture out of the ground quite so fast. So anyway, this is what I'm excited about is my little sprinkler head. And then I have a second one. I don't know if you can see it or not over there. Spraying the corn. Does that show up? I don't know. Maybe I can get a second video of it here. Hold on a sec. This is the uh, other tower that we got. I don't know in this bright sunlight. I don't know how well this will show up. But you can see it. It goes all the way across now. And here in about... Uh, three or four weeks this corn will be as tall as the tower is so you'll still be able to water everything.